They have time. I thought I wasn't talking to you. Yeah, they're fine. At least that's what they tell me. But, you know, if they don't get here soon... Yeah, I'll call you back. Cool. Save Sean, right? He's gonna be okay. Fine, I'll go see for myself. I want to be there when he wakes up. He's not gonna wake up, Dee. I am so sorry. I'm going to go give everyone the good news. I know that Sean Evans is going to be asking about Star and Hope. <clears throat> okay, I'll catch up with you after I talk to Jesse. Okay, bye. Lewis, can you call upstairs and make sure trauma's all in house? Yes, Doctor. What? What's wrong? Oh, it's just precautionary. I just want to get him to the OR, make sure I give him a good repair, make sure there's not anything I missed. No, no, you said he was fine. You said he was stable. And he is, which is why I can make a wider incision and get a better look. Jessica, he was gouged with a rusty steel bar. I just want to make sure there aren't any straight fragments or any bleeding that I didn't catch. Well, it sounds like major surgery. He's going to be fine. Do you promise? I promise. You said I was so scared in the phone. Well, I was, especially for Hope. I had to beg them to give her formula. She kept crying and crying. Bastards. I was so afraid that Sergey was going to hurt her. Especially when he was on the phone with John. He fired a gun and said that he had killed her. Sir, we don't have to go into all that now. Oh, well, maybe she needs to talk about it. It was just awful being tied up to the chair the whole night. And they let me hold hope, but I was just afraid that if I fell asleep, she would, she would fall. Oh. I don't know. You just think that you could reason with people, you know, make a deal, and you try, but they kept saying that they were going to take us away anyway, and I knew that if we got on that plane that we weren't going to make it. It's over. It's not! Look at what they did to you and to Sean! I mean, is Sean even okay? What are you talking about? Of course he's going to wake up. There was a, um, a problem in the old No. Part. This. He's fine. You promised me. Oh, what? kind of a problem, Gregory. Nothing he can't fix. Right, Greg? Tell them Sean's gonna be okay. I can't do that, Tess. What are you saying? He's dead? You killed him? Station, but I wanted to get 
congratulate you on a job well done. Thank you, Commissioner. You know, uh, Star and her baby, they owe you their lives. No, V. You were the first one in. You took the hit. You know, your special ops training experience, it uh, really served you well. Uh, just doing the job. That's right. As far as I'm concerned, you're hired. Sir. The Landview Police Department is proud to have you. Thank you, sir. I'm gonna get back, but uh, I'll see you soon. Soon. Well, congratulations, son. You got a very bright future ahead of you. Stop by the hospital, Brody's out of the woods. When I saw him in the warehouse, it was like. It was like a miracle when he was creeping in the shadows. He got helping me out of there. He really did save us. John, what about Sean? Mm -hmm. Sean was still in surgery, but I talked to his mom and she said it was looking good. No, thanks to you. Okay, what were you thinking, man? He's an 18 year old kid to bust up a drug. He was trying to keep my son out of prison. Oh, I see. By putting his life in danger. And the life's a star in hope. Oh, you're lucky nobody died. Sean's not dead. Oh. Thank you, Jesus. Oh, my God. You scared me half to death. Gregory. I told you he was going to be okay. I can't promise that, Des. I, I wish I could. What are you talking about, son? There was another bullet fragment. A smaller one that threatened a major blood vessel. I managed to grab it, but... But you have to understand. Sean had already gone through a major surgery, and... To open him up again. Gregory, what happened? He had a cardiac arrest on the table. It, it took a while to bring him back. But you saved him. He's okay. He, he's unconscious. But he'll wake up, right? There may have been some deep brain trauma. So you'll fix it. Oh, Des, he was hurt so badly. I, I did everything that I could. No. You're the best surgeon in the world. There's got to be something you can do. The only thing that we can do at this point is monitor him and keep him comfortable. Till he wakes up. He can't just stay like that. Look, there have been cases where um, a patient may remain in what is called a uh, persistent vegetative state. Are you saying that your brother may never wake up again? At this moment, Dad, I honestly don't know. What do you mean you don't know? You have to know. You're the best. You promised me you could fix him. I did the best that I could. Then why did this happen? Answer me. What did you do to him? You said you could fix him. You promised me. You promised me. ABC's One Life to Live brought to you by Sears. Sears, life well spent. Get this fall's hottest looks. Like the boyfriend jacket with skinny jeans. Or the perfect tunic and leggings. Steal this look for under $50. Save 40 to 50% off fall apparel and home fashions. Plus another 15% off with coupons on your Sunday paper and Sears.com. Sears. Life. Well spent. Okay, so. Oh, yes, hi. Can you put my grandma on the phone, please? Thanks. Excuse me, sir. There's a person calling her. We haven't met her. Oh, she thinks it's her super. I'm told. She's in the garden picking herbs. She's so cute. Okay, I'll take it. She's holding. What? Wow. Progresso, you gotta taste this soup. A touch of diamond powder, a hint of calla lily. Beautiful moments are born in the shower. A new diamond infused sensation. New touch of sparkle cream oil body wash from Nivea. Touch and be touched.
fire candles. Blade scented oil candle tins quickly fill the room with fragrance. Hello there. Very nice. Make the mood in a moment with scented oil candle tins. And yes, it's Glade. Do it for less with bonus 3 plus 1 refill packs. SC Johnson, a family company.